Welcome back. Tetet exam rabu tu nanti, dengan saman dengan ciri rojo English subject guna cerdikin skunda, English law vocabulary, idiom skunda ini skuda mana miraj cerdikin skuna, mana tu senior faculty, ambat screen was kerana mana tu orang naru, mik kuda mana doubt sunca screen kira mana tu number phone jesse, mik doubt sunu clarify jesse skor. Nama skaram sir. Tetek saman dengan ciri, ini mungkin English law vocabulary, idioms, ini guna je lah, atau cakap kasih mana tu, entah depth ga cakap call sana asal mana. मंदगा मनोतेवी आर्गनाइजर्स की कंग्रेजुलेशंस आ टीम की कंग्रेजुलेशंस फॉर स्टार्टिंग अनदर इनोवेटिव प्रोग्राम फॉर द बेनिफिट ऑफ कैंडिडेट्स वो प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर टेट एंड देन माय वेल विशेस एंड गुड विशेस तू द कैंडिडेट्स हु आर प्रिपेयरिंग सीरियसली फॉर दिस एग्जाम एंड देन एज इट्स � let us uh, just spend some time on um, TET exam, then we'll get into our topic. As we already announced, our topic for the day is vocabulary in that idiomatic expressions. TET law, meanings of the idiomatic expressions. And uh, as we all know, it's a school-based you know, test with the basic level. Basic law, but uh, idioms is a very typical component of English vocabulary. Its complexity is, uh, let me give the meaning of this idiom. Idiomatic expression or idiom means it may or may not have literal meaning. A word ke as it is ga meaning undak poch, vere meaning undach. Dan adhe dan complexity. Andhu kani kodhi ga learners ki gaani, aspirants ki gaani kodhi bandhi ga hoch. So dan ki particular books refer jo hochu and at the same time, uh, as we have been saying continuously, the school prescribed textbooks, you know, must be read thoroughly. Adi baba tharo ka chhe chadwa la pustakalu. And market books chadwa chugan first basic books chadwin tarathar market books practice chese then I think they'll get the speed. So few points about the exam is you know TED is a must to become private and a government school. पुरे टीचे अलांटे टेट क्वालिफिकेशन कंपलसरी आन पेट आरु एंड डीएससी लोगाने टीएसपीसी एग्जाम्स लोगाने वेटेज फॉर टेट मार्क्स इज गिवेंस अंधे कन गुड़ो देर इस सम सीरियसनेस अबाउट टेट एग्जाम नाउ एंड थर्ड पॉइंट इज टेट क्वालिफाइड पीपल आर वेरी लेस वेरास डिप्लोमा इन एजुकेशन और बैचलर ऑफ एजुक are more, chala mandunna. Maybe because these people are more, the governments have planned another filtering examination because we cannot provide jobs for all the people who have qualifications. And then this TET is the result of National Council for Teacher Education, which has laid rules for teacher recruitment process. So, it will be a guideline for the teacher and the MM categories. Though it is very tiresome, you know, after BA and then a TET and DSC and almost all the candidates have to go through the same syllabus but little variation, with little variation, the tiresome won't be. But if they can keep up the job in mind, service that they are going to give it to the society in mind, I think they will not find it boring. The application part, I will not find it boring. If you want to do it, it will be boring. If you want to do it, it will be boring. So that is my sincere appeal to the candidates. I can understand their boredom in preparing continuously for the exams. And third point is, TET is a must to become a school assistant, SA and secondary grade teacher, SGT. We look at the data exam is very important. Maybe they know, but I think, I thought it would be better if we share. And there are two papers too in the TET, paper one and paper two. Paper one is first to fifth standard school teachers. After that, sixth to eighth standard paper two better. And the English language which carries 30 marks is a compulsory paper. And uh, all the contents are known to us. All the candidates are well versed with 
the content. But again, as we think of the examination, there is a possibility of asking the question from the same syllabus in a difficult manner, a different manner, because the main purpose of the exam is to filter and select the you know, very much balanced uh, candidates. And uh, let us quickly look at the syllabus that we have for TET, so that we, you know, even the candidates can follow our programs in order. I hope most of the candidates have the syllabus. So, we have the basic part, parts of speech, uninclonate. School gives a foundation for English grammar. And uh, all basic grammar for school is a part of our syllabus. So, articles, then tenses, prepositions, types of sentences. Even in basic one more appeal to the candidates is, because these candidates after getting selected, uh, for the DSC or whatever, they have to teach the primary as well as upper primary school students. So, they must try to practice with the basics in mind. Same basics will be tested in the exam, but in a different way. And third application of this test is to train those students in English grammar in a simpler way. Kabati, repu, Students could teach away the idea and governance the ganaka pressure tagutadi. Exam correct as out a debevel mandrasuna, laxamandrasuna, either laxal rasuna, and take the demoralize a problem on the Kabati people should think of the application. And the next is you know we have a degrees of comparison, direct and indirect speech, active and passive voice, questions and question tags, and use of phrases and uh, vocabulary, meanings of idiomatic expressions, correction of sentences, <coughs> sequencing of sentences in a given paragraph. It could be different. paragraph If you can keenly observe, there is a you know link between the Gurukula teachers test, TET, DSC and all. The slight variation. But the pattern of questioning is slightly different. Then uh, we have a uh, composition, could the writing skill look at Ajisarikada. Then comprehension, which is a compulsory part of English syllabus. And then error identification within a sentence. If we basically, we have almost uh, 17 components there. So today we have selected one co important component of vocabulary that is idiomatic hey, oh, expressions. 30 marks on 30, 30 marks. 30 marks on 20. The Gurukula ko almost to mm -hmm. subject. 50 only. 50. And marks ka kunda subject hai the. Yeah. Kothi takko ondi. Kothi takko. Manu chala deep. Chala important. Chala deep kela ra. Ha. 30 marks ante chala important. Ha ah, exactly exactly. Ante it's a deciding factor. Yes. I don't say that English is just a deciding factor. All components, uninclo maximum mustane akada they will be successful. Yes. So they should give equal importance to all the subjects. English law complexity and the manam chosam gatam loguda. Many people have problems with English grammar. Yes. Sir, no? Bhayam guda unta. Bhayam, bhayam antaru, medium unta di. Hmm. Leda rules gurthunda ho, chala tensions unta. We have got lot of calls also. Chala man telugu yeah. medium students unta ka. Adi major ga antar nain telugu medium. Hmm. Puddhu nogudu kundar anaru. So fine, avan unta hai, but in spite of that, one has to, you know, work and go ahead. We had a wonderful program yesterday about civil services. One young girl, it was a good program, good gesture on the part of you know Mana TV. So I think all uh, candidates and youngsters must watch the program too. The, the confidence levels of a girl, in-depth knowledge of yes. the subject, and I think everyone should learn those skills. I really congratulate Mana TV for do, starting such program actually. Then, if we can go to today's topic. Vocabulary low idiomatic exceptions, short uh, idioms and term. The for TET will have a basic level of idiomatic expressions. Whatever we have in the textbooks will be tested and uh, maybe a little more than what textbooks have because you need to think little further, little more. Are they syllabus on the chayochu but fine, could the worst condition good or ready gundali. So, idioms we already said, 
ఇందులో లెట్ ఎస్ డిస్కస్ సమ్ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ కామన్ ఇడమాటిక్ ఎక్స్ప్రెషన్స్ విచ్ గివ్స్ అన్ ఇంట్రొడక్షన్ టు ఇడమాటిక్ ఇంగ్లీష్ సో ఇన్ అవే ఐ కెన్ సే దట్ ఇన్ ఇట్స్ లైక్ ఏబిసి ఆఫ్ ఇడమాటిక్ ఇంగ్లీష్ మీడియమ్స్ చెప్పాలనుకుంటే కొన్ని ఏబిసి ఏబిసి ఇంగ్లీష్ చెప్పాలంటే ఏబిసి రేట్ చెప్పాలో మ్యాథ్స్ చెప్పాలంటే వన్ టూ త్రీ రేట్ చెప్పాలో అట్లా ఐ హ్యావ్ జస్ట్ సెలెక్టెడ్ సమ్ ఇంట్రడక్టరీ కైండ్ ఆఫ్ ఇడమాటిక్ ఎక్స్ప్రెషన్స్ సమ్ వీ హ్యావ్ ఇన్ అ క్వశ్చన్ ఫామ్ టూ ద ఫస్ట్ వన్ ఈజ్ యూనో ద యాపిల్ ఆఫ్ వన్స్ ఐ మీన్ అని ఒకటి తీసుకుంటే బేసిక్ విల్ స్టార్ట్ విత్ ద బేసిక్ లెవెల్ and there are four options if the candidates can see first option is you know main part of the i second option is a favorite person third part is uh, central part of the i fourth is myopic i think a c and d they are related to i yes myopic ante kuda ade it's a kind of a disorder related yes. to i at the average candidate might think that the, they will take the literal meaning of the question so idioms lo atla gaadu it will have some other meaning so apple of one sai ante intlo iddar muguru unte pillalu one child will be an apple of you know father's eye or mother's eye ante favorite child aa child meeda chaala special care istharu enta budget ante ant istharu avanni unte వాళ్ళు తప్పు చేసినా కూడా దే విల్ స్మైల్ ఆన్ ఇంగ్లీష్లో ఒక మనం ఫ్రేజ్ ఉంది స్మైల్ ఆన్ అని స్మైల్ ఆన్ అంటే మనకి ఇష్టమైన వాళ్ళు తప్పు చేస్తే నవ్వు ఊరుకుంటే చిన్నదే అనేది మనకు వాళ్ళు ఇష్టం లేకపోతేనే దాన్ని భూతంతులు పెట్టి చూస్తాం సో యాపిల్ ఆఫ్ వన్స్ ఐజ్ ఇట్ మీన్స్ యూనో వన్స్ ఫేవరెట్ పర్సన్ ఎస్పెషలీ వీ యూజ్ దిస్ అట్ హోమ్ అండ్ ఇన్ స్కూల్ ఆల్సో సమ్ చిల్డ్రన్ దే వెరీ ప్రౌడ్లీ సే దట్ ఐఎమ్ సైన్స్ టీచర్స్ పెట్ ఐ మీ ఇంగ్లీష్ టీచర్స్ పెట్ చెప్పుకుంటారు గొప్పగా ఎందుకంటే టీచర్ కొద్ది మంచి క్వాలిటీస్ ఉంటే అప్రిషియేట్ చేస్తారు అక్కడ బాగా చేస్తున్నామని అంటే ఐ డోంట్ సే దట్ యూనో టీచర్స్ విల్ షో పార్షియాలిటీ టువర్డ్స్ పీపుల్ చిల్డ్రన్ బట్ చిల్డ్రన్ దే జస్ట్ సే నేను ఆ టీచర్ ఫేవరెట్ అనేసి సో అట అట్లా పనికి వస్తుంది ఎగ్జామ్కి పనికి వస్తుంది అన్న కాంటాక్ట్స్లో తీసుకుంటే రెండోది తీసుకుంటే అండర్ ద ఏజెస్ ఆఫ్ వన్ అండ్ ఇంకోటి వన్ మోర్ పాయింట్ హియర్ ఈజ్ ఈ డిమాటిక్ ఎక్స్ప్రెషన్స్ కమ్ అండర్ అ ఫార్మల్ ఇంగ్లీష్ అందులో మరి విల్ డిస్కస్ ఫార్మల్ ఇడమాటిక్ ఎక్స్ప్రెషన్స్ అండ్ ఇన్ఫార్మల్ ఫార్మల్ అంటే వేర్ వీ కెన్ యూజ్ అఫీషియల్లీ ఇన్ అ ప్రొఫెషన్ ఇన్ఫార్మల్ అంటే అది అఫీషియల్ స్టేజ్లో వాడడానికి జస్ట్ ఫర్ ద సేక్ ఆఫ్ డిస్కషన్ సో ఆ రెండు కూడా ఎగ్జాంపుల్స్ చూద్దాం ఎందుకంటే బికాస్ యూ క్యాండిడేట్ షుడ్ నో సో ఇది వెరీ కామన్ ఎక్స్ప్రెషన్ ఈజ్ అండర్ ద ఏజెస్ ఆఫ్ ఫోర్ ఆప్షన్స్ ఇఫ్ యూ లుక్ ఎట్ ఆప్షన్ ఏ ఈజ్ డీటెయిల్డ్ అకౌంట్ ఆప్షన్ బి ఈజ్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ ద ఏజెస్ ఆప్షన్ సి ఈజ్ you know below the age group of and option d is with the support of ikkada ages ante spelling vere unna kuda there is a possibility of committing a mistake age ante ya ee age age okate anukuntaru akkada spelling vere undi that's the reason is most of the exams spelling test is also being conducted a slight addition of a letter will change the whole meaning of the word andukani so option a and uh, option b option c do not match the meaning of the idiom i repeat idiom we are discussing idioms endukada atheli akade na prathi dagara mention cheyaledu give the meaning of this idiom give the meaning of idiom endukada if they look at it as a word they might think that people who watch might think that you know this is not the answer and andukane i am just repeating so with the support of ane the appropriate option for that for example some government programs have been undertaken successfully under the aegis of some private sponsors chaala sarlo government ki fund undakopochu programs ki programs chaala untai so they will take the support of some private organizations who will sponsor financially or materialistically so under the aegis andukane akada bedtharu akada this program is jointly conducted by the government as well as under the aegis of this organization ananta వేరే వాళ్ళ సపోర్ట్ తీసుకొని ఆర్గనైజ్ చేస్తుంది అంట కాంటెక్స్ట్ బికాస్ దిస్ ఇస్ ఆల్సో రెలవెంట్ ఎట్ స్కూల్ లెవెల్ బికాస్ ఎట్ స్కూల్ లెవెల్ దే కండక్ట్ లాట్ ఆఫ్ ప్రోగ్రామ్స్ సో నెక్స్ట్ ఈడియం దట్ వీ హ్యావ్ ఇస్ ఫుల్ ఆఫ్ బీన్స్ ద మీనింగ్ ఆఫ్ ద గివెన్ ఇడమాంటిక్ ఎక్స్ప్రెషన్ ఈస్ అక్కడ ఫోర్ ఆప్షన్స్ ఉన్నాయి ఫోర్ ఆప్షన్స్ ఫస్ట్ ఆప్షన్ ఈజ్ ఫుల్ ఆఫ్ వెజిటబుల్స్ 
full of bean bags full of energy and full of seeds a b and d are irrelevant and they do not match but they have some connectivity beans and beans vegetable variety kada anukochu because the examiner may try to divert the mind of the candidate who is taking the exam and full of bean bags ee madhe na thoga fashion ayipa unnai so ad kaakunda the right option for it is full of energy he is full of beans and he is full of energy some people at any given point of time they are very energetic and active lively happy at any given time kontha mandi poddam telavarina podu kuda dalugane untaru adi vere vishayam then the second idiom is bear fruits the meaning of the given idiomatic expression is idi koddiga alochiste adam chesukochu and one more point here is uh these idiomatic expressions we have come across in our day to day life in our day to day reading and we are studied in books also but because we did not use it seriously earlier maybe we have some kind of a nervousness ante so bear fruits general vaade man koddi ga alochiste but let us look at the examples uh, options please uh, option a says you know to produce the results option b healthy tree option c fruit bearing variety of trees and option d is to produce healthy variety of fruits so you could bear fruits as we have already discussed idiom idiomatic expression doesn't or may not take the literal meaning of the words used in the expression so fruit at a literal meaning rakapochu ravachu rakapochu ikkada ledhu so bear fruits ante here to produce the results and a, a sincere hard work will always bear fruits kashtapadi pan cheste results vastadi though little late or uh, though after a lot of difficulties every person sincere hard work will definitely bear fruits ee context lo vaaduntam manam ee context anangane appudu kuda sound i have listened to it or i have used it anustadi so uh, one should try to recollect and the best way of recollecting the idiomatic expressions for the candidates is to read something daily so if you read read daily one way or the other you will come across these idiomatic expressions 50% of that you may know and maybe little with little effort you will recollect the meaning of it kodiki nerchukovali mans petti then if you can look at uh, the other one of the beans the meaning of the given idiomatic expression is malli bean ochindi ikkada but of if you can look at is a negative expression o double f o f is a preposition argadi me that talks about belongingness then if you can look at the options option a says of seeds beans and seeds option b is of target option c is inaccurate and option d is b and c both kuda tricky aitundi melliga mana question type rendu options lo unnai anals b and c so they have to apply their mind you know to find out the right option so of the beans adi as we already discussed idioms may not take literal meanings so of seeds this age ante tricky undi ikkada b c either b gavali c gavali ledha rendu aithe d gavali for the trick card but if they know if they have a reading habit they can easily identify ikkada of the beans ante both d both b and c of target and inaccurate ante unfocused ante a target kanna drushti vere daggara povadam so the diversion of you know target goal of the beans some people this while they start they will focus on the goal after some time maybe they will be detract so of the beans avutund all the people have potentiality can adhe kodiga vere issues raavadam tho concentration be at loss of the beans anedi one should not be of the beans once they start their you know journey then the other one is you know bear with someone's someone the meaning of the given expression idi kuda very common maybe most of the candidates were preparing seriously 
um, might have you know, got the idea. Bear with someone. We, we have to bear with someone in life. And this is the other thing. Options are not going to be School level, I guess, the total. Yeah. Chala easy. Easy, easy. No? In Kogati, what we have selected is, we have selected some things for the benefit of students and teacher for the exam. Three levels row, like this. So, we can also teach this. The meaning is uh, so useful for the students also. Patients are all level and teach ali. School level and air pinch all values. And the kind of selected. So, bear with someone and uh, should them options. To be intolerant, to be impatient, to be patient, to be patience. A and B are not relevant. And then, but we have a tie between C and D. We have just made it a little tricky. And their knowledge of grammar also may be tested. So, to be patient structurally right, to be patience structurally not right. To have patience unta di. But the third option C is the appropriate for the given. So, we, we need to bear with someone if, you know, the situation demands in the larger interest of the organization or the society or the project. I interest lo kuni saru barinchal sustad kuni. Painful situations hai na guna. Then we have another very common idiomatic expression. I have mentioned in the question, INF and better, and informal. Because uh, we should know, consider informal the formal situation lo the bound. But we have to teach, and a teacher has to teach formal as well as informal things. Anirakala training school ne jarutadi. That's why we still remember and cherish uh, our teaching days, school days. We may not have lot of memories of our college and uh, university days, school days chala bound. So next idiom we have is you know, a bud of roses. And the meaning of the given idiomatic expression is very common in the Buddha. So, if you can look at the options, first option is you know, full of thorns, thorns and mullu. Second option is flower arrangement. Third option is you know ikebana. Third, fourth option is comfortable. As we have been discussing, idiom may not literally take the meaning of the words of the expression, right? So, roses and roses say kakapoch, inka something else undoch. So, the bed of life is not a bed of roses. And the epudu ananda lo santosha lo positive way undo. Negative results could ostai. In fact, those negatives test how strong you are. So, manami idiomatic experience teaches to walak life could teach it. School level lo. Not simply making them, you know, SSC writing machines. They should grow up, evolve. They should come out of their age. So, bed of roses and comfortable. comfortable. Bed of roses is a comfortable. Life is not a bed of roses. Pillala teacher under Kastal Buddha. Chandra Chalman the parents who ma pillala Kastal Rao than Anta Bajus Kuntur. Chinna Tarava Chinna Pralam as a Tatko Edward. So, Anni Chel Chapali. Explain just the better. And not everything, whatever they can take. So, thorns, flower, rose related, flower arrangement. Ikebana is, you know, is a Japanese art of flower arrangement. Next one is, you know, another common, intentionally I skipped the options for this. So, this, I just wanted to explain that. Is beggars can't be choosers. And what is the meaning of this idiomatic expression? Beggars, ante, ante, we should not take the literal meaning. Ante, when you don't have anything, you should accept whatever is given to you, whatever comes to you first. Job, I have a job. I have a collector job. I have a customer. First, to get one job. Survive, take care of yourself, then work. In Lena put Erichana, this calls it. Atla context loss, the beggars can't be choosers. When you don't have anything, you should accept context loss. Then we have uh, 
as clear as bell quite interesting idiom the meaning of this particular idiomatic expression is as clear as bell options even i very strong as metal as structured as a bell design as good as sound very easy to hear first three options do not match because they are directly related to the word of that idiomatic expression as it is word crack pooch so as clear as it bell sound chala clear untadu ante because of the constituents of that metal konni metals kalpi tayar chesina adi bell bell metal anu untadi chemistry lo chala clear sound ivvali ante positive vibrations ivvali ani dan design chestha so the meaning of this given expression is very easy to hear so your speech your communication must be as clear as bell anna context lo vaadochu so in the exam they can test this idiomatic knowledge through sentence form or a direct question form or other way it's a caller ready go yeah, okay. caller hello mi peru mi ekka nunchi maatladtha ani cheppi mi prashna adigandi hello hello రైట్ సార్ కాల్ కట్ అయింది సార్ అలాగే ఇంగ్లీష్లో ఎన్ని ఈడియమ్స్ ఉంటాయి సార్ ఎన్ని రకాల దట్స్ ఎ ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ క్వశ్చన్ దానికి ఎండ్ లేదు చాలా ఉన్నాయి ఒక యాబ్లరీ అంటే అది చాలా ఉన్నాయి అందులో అదే ఫార్మల్ ఇన్ఫార్మల్ ఉంది ఉన్నాయి డిక్షనరీస్ డిక్షనరీస్ ఉన్నాయి దానికి అన్ని నేర్చుకోవాలంటే కష్టమే బట్ ఇఫ్ యూ హ్యావ్ ప్యాషన్ ఫర్ ఇట్ ఐ థింక్ యూ కెన్ టెట్కు సంబంధించి నేర్చుకుంటే సరిపోతుంది టెట్కు సంబంధించి అదే బేసిక్ బేసిక్ even we started with basic uh, yeah. idiomatic expressions basics are put in chala high undadu endukante this syllabus is from the school syllabus school syllabus and uh, tomorrow they have to teach this syllabus to school kids oh, yes they are not going to teach university students so anta high ga undadu so they should you know keep that in mind chala unta interesting unta basic nets kote sar pothu basic they should go by the syllabus a yeah. textbooks తీసుకొని కొద్దిగా టైం దొరికితే కొద్దిగా వేరేగా నేర్చుకుంటే దట్ గివ్స్ ఎ కాన్ఫిడెన్స్ అండ్ గివ్స్ ఎన్ ఎక్స్ట్రా ఎడ్జ్ ఓవర్ అదర్ క్యాండిడేట్స్ కాంపిటీషన్ కదా సో వేరే వాళ్ళకు కొద్దిగా ఎక్కువ వస్తే కాన్ఫిడెన్స్ ఎక్కువ కాన్ఫిడెన్స్ ఎక్కువ ఉంటే నాలెడ్జ్ ఎక్కువ ఉంటే దే కెన్ సాల్వ్ మ్యాక్సిమం క్వశ్చన్స్ అండ్ దే కెన్ గెట్ మ్యాక్సిమం స్కోర్ మ్యాక్సిమం స్కోర్ అంతే కదా ఇట్స్ రన్నింగ్ రేస్ కంటిన్యూ రేస్ సో నెక్స్ట్ ఎక్స్ప్రెషన్కి వెళ్తే ఐ హ్యావ్ అదర్ త్రీ ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ ఏరియమ్స్ one is you know a bird in the hand is worth two in the bush idi kuda chaala meaningful expression ante every idiomatic expression is meaningful but according to the situation we should select so a bird in ante generally uh, why i have selected this you know is you know we can teach this to students also pillalaku teliyali okati unnappudu dan jaratha chusukomani child psychology ante idi anni naake kavalani psychology handle cheyalekapoyina kuda anni kavali antu so we need someone has to teach this so unnadi jaradukunte chalu len dan kosam vemparladutu unnadi kuda pogottukodu ana meaning vastadi then other one is birds of a feather idi chala traditional idiomatic expression they stand a chance in the exam too birds of a feather din full expression kuda undi konni saru inte adagochu ledha full adagochu konni saru atla kuda test cheyochu birds of feather flock together that's a caller ready yeah. answer this one hello hello mi peru mi ekka nunchi maatladtunna cheppi mi prashna adigandi hello hello maatladandi hello sir good afternoon na peru prashant good afternoon prashant go on nenu hyderabad nunchi call chestunnani okay the test exam test exam eligibility entandi nadi b com అవునా యాక్చువల్లీ మీరు వాళ్ళ వెబ్సైట్కి వెళ్ళి చూడండి దెర్ ఆర్ టూ లెవెల్స్ యాక్చువల్లీ యాజ్ ఫార్ యాజ్ వినో ఒకటి ఏమో డిప్లొమా ఎడ్యుకేషన్ చేసిన వాళ్ళకు ఉంది ఒకటి బిఎడ్ ఇంకా కొన్ని వేరే చాలా ఉన్నాయి ఇక్కడ ఎలిజిబిలిటీస్ మీరు వాళ్ళ వెబ్సైట్లో చూడండి ఒకసారి మీరు కేవలం బీకామ్ చేసి ఉంటే మాత్రం మీరు ఎలిజిబుల్ కాదండి బీఈడీ ఆర్ డిఈడి చేసి ఉండాల్సి ఉంటుంది ఒకసారి మీరు టేస్పేసి వెబ్సైట్ చూస్తే మీకు క్లియర్ గా ఉంటుంది అందులో ఓన్లీ బీకామ్ చేస్తే మాత్రం మీరు ఎలిజిబుల్ కాదు 
ओके सर कंटिन्यू आंसर ओके सो बर्ड्स ऑफ ए फेदर और बर्ड्स ऑफ ए फेदर फ्लॉक टुगेदर इधर कॉमन मानो स्कूल लेवल वालों चूज़ तो उन्हें वाला के नच्छने वाला ग्रुप तो नहीं उन्हें वालों वेदर इट इज़ सिटिंग इन द क्लासरूम आर हैविंग देर लंच आर शेयरिंग सम स्पेशल स्वीट्स और व्हाटेवर आर वेदर देर थिंकिंग लेवल्स मैच देर आइडियाज मैच देर गोल्स मैच इपुरो चाला हाई स्टैंडर्ड चल स्कूल लेवल वाले पीले लकी चाला नालू जोच सो अटला बर्ड्स ऑफ फेदर अन्ना गुड़ा बर्ड्स ऑफ फेदर फ्लॉक टू केदर अन्ना गुड़ा बर्ड्स ऑफ सेम फेदर फ्लॉक टू केदर अन्ना गुड़ा ऑल द थ्री मीन द सेम मींस पीपल विद सेम आइडियाज इंटरेस हॉबीज गोल्स दे मूव टुगेदर दे ग in quote on the early bird, early bird is a very suitable you know, expression for the students, school students. Early bird enters someone who comes early, someone who wakes up early, someone who takes the first step, first initiative, will always get the good results. Second, the third, maybe you will miss wonderful opportunities. And a context loss. Then we have uh, one more. Uh, Question type, idiomatic expression, common, a bitter pill to swallow, leda, only it can be tested as a bitter pill, full form a bitter pill to swallow or a bitter pill. F ante, it's a formal expression and the official word. So what is the meaning of this bitter pill? Apply yes, if you can apply your mind, you can guess. Maybe you can also try. Okay. Pill ante telsu matra. Bitter ante chedu. Okay. The chedu matra antam. Can you idiomatic expression lo vere onto the good dia? Okay. And the kani the options are the first option is good medicine, something difficult, powerful medicine, children's medicine. As we have been discussing, it may not have literal meaning. So A, C, D. Ruled out. Yeah. Ah, something difficult. And but I can say that you know, for all the aspirants, they are very good at uh, all their core subjects, but the English subject is a bitter pill to swallow. English yes. grammar and English subject and the syllabus man any Japina simple gana on the books on the material and the Japina Buddha, Kontapandaka material good on the Intel and the Tolopusakal good on Jupiter Kondaru. Right? So, it, it, it has become a bitter pill to swallow. But one has to take the bitter pill for a good health. So, one has to work sincerely towards English to be successful in a context of this coach. Then we have a similar category, pill. Matral matar tunamura, then related to one or two discussions. Sugar the pill, the meaning of the given expression, idiomatic expression is. Four options only. Divert the mind of the patient, talk sweetly while administering the bitter pill, take sugar along with bitter pill, sugar coat the bitter pill. Four options only. Are you getting me? Option A, option B, option C are ruled out. Are you getting me? So sugar the pill and pill and matra, any medicine generally will be will not be tasty, will be bitter. चेद करने उठता दी, मानूँ बैलेंस ये कुछ तीनम का बाटे चेद माताल दिन आसुस्त दी, अब बाटे चेदे उठता दी, so what they do is especially children's tablets are sugar coated, वाला टॉन एक सिरप अन्य गुड़ा तीया कुंटे, they love the flavour taste, माना कि चेवे कुदे चेदी इच्छा सर डायरेक्ट का, so sugar तो पिल अंटे, first is sugar coat, the bitter pill नो कोट रूंडी, okay, but Sugar the pill in idiomatic way has another meaning too. Okay. That means if any bitter thing is there, negative thing is there which people may not like. Okay. Manak Telugu la samatu kunde. Antani shturam karna adini shturam mele do antaru. Karna kudu kasta manu yorkan a chappadan ki bandi varta antam chappali puru ashogar mistake jese chappdam itla chappdam itla yedam itla dis kunte roan chala alochin chappadam e modles tu manam. Can you tell me about the mistake? Are you getting me? 
So, we need to sugar the pill. Yoro anaran kudle lele ashok kudhe sensitive manishi jarathaka maata dal saarante. So, what we need to do is we need to sugar the pill. A chepe yado chala sweet ga atla ni yado chepe motan chepe se an chepal sindi. So, we need to say that bitter thing, negative thing, uncomfortable thing in a sweeter manner. Our context logo does the bigger. Okay. Then we have another common one, black sheep. What is the meaning of this idiomatic expression? We always say every house has a black sheep, every family has a black sheep, every classroom has a black sheep, every society has a black sheep, every organization has a black sheep. This black sheep ki chala means nahi. Let us look at the given options. Dark complexion option A, irrelevant. Second one, lazy person. Third is sheep in black color. I rule out JH. most of And the fourth is unknown talent. Here we have a tie between B and D. Here endu mana kudhi ke same one piston di. Adi ko kela chado ko pointe we have a problem. And we need to read a lot. We need to learn as many idioms as possible. Chala dels kunte anti. Itlaan te tricky idiom ichna. Unna schools idiom gora tricky ichna gora. We can easily identify the meaning of it. We had seen that in Gurukula test. It was a tricky guy. As we discussed, it was very helpful for the candidates. So, black sheep is a lazy person, unknown talent. Unknown talent is irrelevant there. So, lazy, undesirable person, uncomfortable person, person who doesn't take everything seriously. Ah, no father property in the third party, type of type. There is a lot of work. Right? You can see that there is a lot of DGP. Yes. Youngsters are creating a lot of disturbance in the society, misdriving, wrong driving, rash driving, killing people. Avani. Parents aim just to mobile phone use, misuse just to Avani That's a point, serious point. Then news go to the media, DGP, got to work, got to work, got to work. So black sheep, yes, every family must identify the black sheep. If today he is not doing something, he might do something wrong tomorrow. So it is our job to, you know, focus on that. School logo da black sheeps unda. Black sheeps ne lazy ante ardanga kunda kuda kuda ribbandi badachu. The teacher must. Andi ke valak cycle ajane paper bata teachers. Then we have another one, a blessing in disguise. This one it has a lot of meaning. We have a very lengthy options for that. Gradually we are making it little complex. The options and the type of questions. So first option is something that proved to be unfortunate after seeming fortunate. Second option is something that proved to be fortunate after seeming unfortunate. Third option is something that assumed to be fortunate after seeming unfortunate. And fourth option is something that proved to be fortunate after seeming fortunate. Okay? Four options tricky ka unnai. Andula see rule out jayach. Into assume. Assumptions ki chance leed. Uhinche uha lak chance leed akada. Fourth option would Juddha Matlana. Something that uh, proved to be fortunate after seeming fortunate. That is good meaning lay that. 50 out. So we have A and B. Something that proved to be unfortunate. Kadu. A blessing in disguise and term. And the Konisarlu, Manakistam Lane Department to Gudaman and Post Chester, transfer Chester. Kotala with the Badabarth mean and Nikadam Pishnaru, Nane the Toki Bade and Kwam Pishnar and Kotse Karsu just Kunta Basni. Can you tell me that wherever you have been posted, you are the right person there? Congratulations, Mr. Narasimhari. Congratulations, Mr. Narasimhari. Then later you will say it's a blessing in disguise. Sir, you don't have to worry about it. You don't have to worry about it. It's a nice opportunity. Ah, meaningless. And the second option, something that proved to be fortunate after seeming unfortunate. This is not a system. Everyone undergoes this phase. So, if you want to teach, you can teach. At the school level, you can teach a lot of values. You can teach a lot of problems. You can teach a lot of parents and a lot of society. Then we have another one. Very, very common. Blue blood. And what is the meaning of this, you know, idiomatic expression? We have four options. We have already gone through. 
ऑप्शन ए इज एजुकेटेड फैमिली ऑप्शन बी मिडिल क्लास रॉयल फैमिली पॉवर्टी ड्रिवेन और पॉवर्टी स्ट्रिक ए बी एंड डी इरेलेवेंट कुछ मन न्यूज पेपर चली वाली पुस्तक चलते वी जनरली कम अक्रॉस दिस् ब्लू ब्लाट अट रायल फैमिल रायल ब्लाट अरिस्टोक्राटिक फैमिल आर्टिकल इन के आलो इन सम ट्रैब इन फारेस्ट ए दर्जो कि राजर कम ना आईब सेम ट्रडिशन वाल गवर्नमेंट अंत वाल मंत्री अंदर एन मंदिर मंत्री वाल वील अंड द गवर्नमेंट इज हेलिंग दें सो रायल ब्लड इन मेनी आस्पेक्ट दर्स फैमिल हू कम फ्रम द रायल ग्रउंड अंड वी हाव सम important idioms someone's brain child someone was telling me yesterday that you know that first program of civil services was someone's brain child okay idea it became a hit brain child someone's brain child ante vaalla medassu nundi vaalla medadu nundi vaalla aalochana nundi puttin dan antu edana kotta ga putte so someone's brain child ani or it's a brain child of someone etla nanochu so brain child ante it doesn't literally mean a child it's a concept idea a program a scheme maybe all politicians they have new ideas to stay in the you know government second the idiomatic expression is burn the candle at both ends generally we burn the candle at one end ante kontha mandi chaala rigorous ga hard work chestaru enta hard work chestaru ante kontha mandi exam hall lo padipoyanta work kuda chestaru so burning the candle at both ends ante taking unnecessary extra hard work to complete your task and which may be a wasteful effort than result raakapochu anta hard work chesthe kuda anduke nowadays we don't uh, you know prescribe hard work we prescribe you know smart work manalu manu jarata kaapadukuntu work cheyalantaru and then the other is you know hold out a carrot a very interesting school based idiomatic expression din ki go expression kuda show the carrot kuda antaru idi management lo vaartaru show the carrot ani din full version endante hold out a carrot for the rabbit ledha show the carrot to the rabbit the rabbit loves carrot and if you want the rabbit to come to you if you show a fresh you take in carrot then it will come to you it will be friend with you so atlane hold out a carrot ante school level lo kuda mostly teachers announce some surprise prizes four finishes this work will be given this rank edo medal antar label antar or prize antar that so many things incentives they'll give so a school a teacher generally sometimes they spend from their own pocket to encourage the children because at government level they, they will not be given extra fund to you know do that to encourage personally but that shows their you know passion towards profession vaallu vaallu maa teachers kuda kudar vaallu santa double tone kuda maaku presents ichinaru na so hold out a carrot is one the other one is build castles in the air school level lo idu kuda avasarame build castles ante koddi ardham avutadi aakasham lo armyalu chudu ante lekapothe uha lo nirpi nirminchadam so em em undadu bore meeda they will not do so they will always build castles in there so practicality lo undaru pragmatic ga undaru ground level lo undaru bhoomi meeda unda aalochanalu anaka as we should teach that then we have one question type who will bell the cat cat related idioms ikoni option a undi take the lead disturb the sleeping cat invite the cat for milk let the cat go out of the house b c d are ruled out the only option which suits the meaning of the given idiomatic expression is take the lead who will bell the cat ante who will start who will be the first person to start the program ante group lo unnapudu eppudu koddiga nervousness untadi nen first raanu meer cheyandi meer cheyandi anustuntaru so someone should bell the you know cat our context like a cat something like that then we have another cat related idiom there 
curiosity kill the cat idi kuda children ki explain cheyalsina idiomatic expression children student level lo school level etlu untaru prathi okkati telusukovalanukuntaru idi enti adi enti personal ga touch chesi adi chesi cheyalanukuntaru akkada anta curiosity manchidi gaadu ana context lo untaru idi kada okay ante edanna telusukovalani elthe dani we may mishandle that we may do more harm to it akkada we have we should know how to handle things ante we should not have that much of curiosity which will which will lead to you know distraction we should know before handling argumento and the question we have is you know let the cat out of the bag and the meaning of the given idiomatic expression is option a we have is you know uh, give freedom to the cat trouble the cat reveal the secret spend meaninglessly a b and d are not at all suitable for that let the cat out of the bag and the a context lo vartham ante in revealing the secrets the magicians vaadutuntaru adi general ga atla so we should not let the cat out of the bag ante we should not reveal the secret secret to secret untane baa untadi adi baitaku vaste danikanna beauty undadu charm undadu and this is one undadu so this is one and we have uh, one more idiomatic expression a common a wild goose chase idugada we need to discuss you know for the students as well and a very important uh, idiomatic expression wild goose chase ante our life should not be a wild goose chase ante we should not run after something which we are not sure of manaku adu undo ledo existing undo ledo telikonda adu veel avutado kaado telavakonda eligibility undo ledo telavakonda blind ga prepare gaavadam blind ga ellipovadam it's like a wild goose chase ninna సివిల్ సర్వెంట్ సర్వీస్ నేను అమ్మాయి చెప్పింది కదా చాలా క్లియర్గా చెప్పింది అంత రైట్ ఫ్రమ్ ద ప్రిలిమినరీ ఎగ్జామ్ టు ద ఇంటర్వ్యూ ప్యానల్ గురించి కూడా తెలుసుకోవాలి అని మంచిగా అనిపించింది అది ఆ స్ట్రాటజీ ఉంది కాబట్టి మేబీ షీ గాట్ సక్సెస్ సో చదివాలి కూడా డిఎస్సి రాస్తామనుకొని చదవాలి అంతే ఉండా ఆ స్కెచ్ చేయాలి అల్టిమేట్లీ ఎస్ సార్ ను అప్పుడు ఈజీ అవుతుంది లేకపోతే దీని తర్వాత దీని తర్వాత అంటే కష్టమవుతుంది అది వాళ్ళ సర్క్ అట్లా ఉంటుంది సో ఇట్ షుడ్ నాట్ బి వైల్డ్ గూస్ చేసి ఏదో రాసేస్తే ఎలిజిబిలిటీ ఉంది కదా అని కాకుండా ఒక సీరియస్ ప్లాన్ వేసి చేస్తే బాగుంటుంది అండ్ దెన్ ద అదర్ రీజన్ ద చికెన్ అండ్ ద ఎగ్ అయితే ఇది మనకు తెలుగులో చాలా వాడతాం గుడ్డు ముందా కోడి ముందా అని అంటుంటారు జనరల్గా అది దానికి ఈడియోమాటిక్ ఎక్స్ప్రెషన్ ఇది ద చికెన్ అండ్ ద ఎగ్ అంటారు అంటే ఇట్ మీన్స్ ద సేమ్ and whenever you have a confusion or a controversial discussion you know i am better you but you, know, you are not and edanna vache argument vachina kuda aa context lo konni kashtam avi cheppadam we may not have a scientific reason atlanti a discussion chesina kuda idiom is you know suitable the chicken and the egg he always argues in a chicken and the egg you know manner and then we have one more because we picked up one idiom related to eggs is count one's eggs before they are hatched idi manam teach cheyal chala meaningful idiomatic expression kuda count one's eggs before they are hatched ante manaku adi inka chethuloku raakam munde danni ante ante especially the middle class salary raakam munde lekkele seskuntaru idi idi nestaru kodiga yes sir no adu vachin tarata malli ibbandi aitadi konni saru raakapochu anukunna amount ఆ టైంకి ఇస్తాను ఇవ్వకపోవచ్చు కూడా ప్రా ఇబ్బందులు పడతాం సో డోంట్ ఆల్వేస్ కౌంట్ ఓకే మేక్ ఎ మూవ్ వన్స్ యు గెట్ దాట్ యా రైట్ సో వన్ షుడ్ నాట్ కౌంట్ వన్స్ ఎగ్స్ బిఫోర్ ది ఆర్ హ్యాచ్డ్ ఇంకా అది రిజల్ట్ రాకముందే అవన్నీ అవసరం లేదు అది గట్టి అన్న కాంటాక్ట్స్లో వస్తుంటుంది ఇది అండ్ ఇట్ హ్యాస్ ఎగ్జామినేషన్ బెనిఫిట్ ఎట్ ద సేమ్ టైమ్ అవర్ పర్సనల్ వాల్యూ సిస్టమ్ బెనిఫిట్ chala meaningful expressions we have uh, one more work against the clock the simple expression gundi against the clock gundi antaru ante so candidates must know the full fuller expression of idioms also konsa sar fully ivachu leda half common ivachu kabatti fuller nerchukunte better so work against andukani full kuda manam discuss chestunnam work against the clock ante 
against the clock ante asalu unna time kanna ekko extra work cheyali ante for example they say uh, for a healthy personality one should have at least uh, 6 to 8 hours proper sleep antaru kani kontha mandi minimum exams unnapudu 2 hours kuda padukoru kontha mandi exam mundu padukoru exam ayin tarvata kontaru antaru so any case wherein you are crossing beyond the time schedule that one should not practice than antam even I think the successful people whom we discussed about yesterday also, they might have worked, she might have worked against the clock. We didn't know. We were only observing the smile and uh, the fluent uh, communication. Maybe when she was preparing for the exam, she was working against the clock. When you have a serious exam. Then we have as cool as cucumber. Very calm and easy. And uh, it means, you know, a very calm and composed person and who is not at all worried and not at all upset for any kind of a situation. And the boss kunta general ga. Subordinates kunta bochu. Boss ki anta pedda problem ochi na guda manam chepi na guda he will generally uh, be relaxed and he will listen to the problem and then he will think uh, what to do. We generally don't observe that uh, tension in the boss face. So some a good boss must be as cool as cucumber and I think not only boss but all of us must be as cool as cucumber because tension creates unnecessary health disorders. We have one more question type, a dark horse, the meaning of the given idiomatic expression is, there are four lengthy expressions. A dark horse means more is known about a person's abilities, nothing is known about a person's abilities little is known about a person's abilities, disabilities, little is known about a person's abilities. So dark horse and generally if a horse is white, everyone can see it. If the dark has a, uh, a horse has a dark complexion then I think it is difficult. Horse is known for energy strength. So this is used to refer to a person wherein a little is known about a person's abilities. All like abilities untai chala, capabilities untai, potentialities untai. But telik poch. That's a phone call already under. Hello? That's a call cut in the continuous Okay. So a dark horse is this. And this I think uh, uh, as teachers we should look at the students also. They have abilities. So we need to look at So we have one more very important common idiomatic expression is on the top of the world. If as teachers, if we can train students in a comprehensive way, if we can give all kinds of all-rounder training to them, if we teach them everything about life and you know, preparation, importance of goals and all, I think after they achieve the success, they'll feel on the top of the world. And on the top of the world, ante are options. Option is feeling proud of something, feel very happy, and feel sad about, and feel depressed. C and D generally we don't take up negative. So feel proud or feel very happy. So on the top of the world, ante today he is on the top of the world, ante he is feeling very happy. Ecstasy under English synonyms this ecstatic. On cloud nine good in idiomatic expression. On cloud nine and motam boom and thicker than in Okane Anta successful and anta happy on the top of the world. I think as teachers we need to you know train students to be on the top of the world. Well happy ground to training you also. Right, sir, you some of my friends, sir. But the English subject low idioms gunchi tells kundam sir. Meta Meta Vati Kunchi next class lo tells kundam. Idiom class is the last okay class on the cover tea bed to loco is subject to me just for channel answer. So one very common you know appeal is to refer the prescribed textbooks first. If they are going for a paper one or paper two, go by the syllabus. And then additional material that is available in the market. And another is uh, refer the previous question papers and then wherever there is weakness, then work on it. That's so, caller, final. Okay. Hello? Hello? 
హలో మీ పేరు మీరు ఎక్కడి నుంచి మాట్లాడుతున్నారు చెప్పి ప్రశ్న అడగండి మేడం చెప్పండి యా స్వప్న చెప్పండి చెప్పండి మాట్లాడండి గుడ్ ఈవినింగ్ చెప్పండి అవును చెప్పండి మీరు టీవీ సౌండ్ పెట్టారు అందుకే టైం మీటర్ అడగండి ఫాస్ట్ గా ఎందుకంటే టైం కూడా లేదు అడగండి కాల్ కాల్ కట్ అయింది సార్ థ్యాంక్ యూ సార్ ఇక ఇంగ్లీష్ లో మిగతా సబ్జెక్ట్ నుంచి తర్వాత క్లాస్ లో తెచ్చుకుందాం సార్ ఈ రోజు ఈడియన్స్ గురించి చాలా విలువైన సమాచారం అందించారు సార్ థ్యాంక్ యూ సార్ ఇది ఈ రోజు సబ్జెక్ట్ రేపు మరో అంశంతో మళ్ళీ కలుద్దాం టెట్ టెట్ కి సంబంధించి క్లాసెస్ ప్రతి రోజు కూడా కంటిన్యూస్ గా మన టీవీ మీకు అందిస్తుంది ఈ ప్రోగ్రామ్ మిస్ అయిన వాళ్ళు యూట్యూబ్ లో చూసే అవకాశం ఉంది మన టీవీ స్వాప్ నెట్ డాట్ కాం లో కూడా ఈ ప్రోగ్రామ్ చూడవచ్చు నమ